good morning guys i literally say that every single time i start a vlog but we're going with it um welcome back to my channel so i have not posted in a week um obviously the whole situation with the world i was like you know what i need a little bit of a break and especially as prep ended like my head was like boom so much going on um but i'm back um and before this video will be an alpha elite haul but today I am going to be doing a full day of eating because you guys love these. And this is basically like quarantine or what I eat in a day. Now prep is done. Training five days a week as usual, three leg days and two upper days, um, two rest days a week because my body needs it. These home workouts are actually still killing me. We have a barbell and dumbbells that weigh up to 25 kg. Um, and then we have a couple of resistance bands. We have nothing crazy, nothing heavy. But we're working with it. In terms of food, we've increased it. We're gradually increasing it again, just seeing how my body responds. But obviously, we wanted to stay below, like around the 70 kg mark. Bear with Lola in the scar side. Um, we wanted to stay below well, around the 70 kg mark. So that was like three kg above my lowest weigh in. Um, because obviously, if I was competing at the end of this year, we didn't want to make it too hard for myself. Um, but we have no idea, no idea how long this is going to last for. So we're just, we're playing it by ear. Um, obviously the heaviest I got to off season was 70, 70, I think it was 76 or 77. I can't remember, I've written it down somewhere. But basically it was, I, I lost like seven or eight, yeah, something like that, like, how much did I lose? I can't remember. Basically, I lost like a fair bit of weight, um, which obviously is needed. And I don't want to put it all back on it in one go in case I'm going to be competing again soon. So that's the plan. I'm rambling anyway. Um, for breakfast, I'll show you now while I'm talking. I'm having my usual, I'm having baked oats. They're still like, I'm loving them. I'm having 60 grams of baked oats, protein powder, blueberries, and then some skinny, um, what is it? skinny co yeah the skinny food company that's it um basically they're billionaires shortbread sauce which has nothing in it they sent it to me absolutely loving it this is not an ad nothing at all it was gifted but you guys always ask how they are um and i'm gonna be honest i don't like the golden syrup i think it's water um and i'd rather have golden syrup because i always have my pancakes um but yeah the billionaires one is delicious especially with baked oats because with the blueberries it tastes like i'm eating a, a um blueberry muffin and i love love blueberry muffins this is my baked oats we have the billionaires shortbread and then also i'll be topping it with a little bit of this which is actually it tastes like nutella please ignore my nails um and i've put blueberries in there so it tastes like a blueberry muffin delicious i'm kind of half tracking so I'm like tracking, but not tracking. I kind of, I know in my head how much I should be eating in terms of protein. Um, and yeah, I've rambled. Breakfast is served guys, that way. Um, and today is back day. Also, hello to the new addition called an Apple Watch. So I got half an eye for his birthday. I had to treat myself um, as well. I got, we got us the series three watch and I'm loving these, um, not for the calories and like tracking that, it's just, Especially as I sit, um, like I sit down and work all day, it just gets me moving a little bit more um, because it sends you reminders of, please stand up. And I'm like, oh, okay, I have, clearly haven't moved for a couple of hours. Um, but yeah, I'm loving these. And also you can walkie talkie each other. I think, I did I add it in a vlog? I started to vlog the other day and then just stopped. Um, but yeah, you can walkie talkie through like, so Harv's at work now and I can walkie talkie him even though he's the other side of Southampton. Like how cool is that? Lunch is ready. So I have 150 grams of chicken. I've got some Brussels, some sweet corn, some tomatoes, um, lots of lettuce and then also some light salad cream. And then I'm going to put chicken on top of that bagel. But then I've got a marmite, a half marmite bagel there. So one whole bagel and then some chicken basically. So it's now... It's 1.30 and I have just had my lunch as you will have just seen or are seeing now. Um, basically, I try and train, at, ooh, I'm holding the camera by the way. I try and train between like 11 to one, like with all my cardio and get everything done, upload Instagram and all of that. Because then I have lunch at like 1.32 and then it means I can have my third meal at like 3.00, four and then it's dinner time like meal 
four yeah meal four at like six seven so try and like really prolong my meals for the afternoon just because that works better for me and i'm such a snacker in the afternoon the morning i'm not so bad it's it's the evening like i'm an i'm a nightmare um but yeah so that was my lunch it was delicious i'm loving a chicken salad at the moment and then a bagel on the side i basically make like a, a chicken bagel sandwich um but so good and so refreshing especially when it's so hot um but yeah now i'm gonna crack on with some more work and then i'm gonna have my pancakes in a little bit Also, pancake recipe, I cannot tell you guys that just yet. I need to wait until the 9th of May and then I can share all the love for the pancakes. Um, they are delicious, I absolutely love them. There's 35 grams of protein, or 32 I think, in that one portion. There's about four grams of carbs and I think two grams of fat or something. They are perfect, literally perfect for just if you are struggling on protein, um, but I'll be updating you guys on that exciting news very soon. However, I need some chocolate. Like the pancakes are good, they're good for cravings with the golden syrup, but just, I am a sucker for pick a mix and a sucker for the white mice. I've got a whole box here. And in fairness, I do also have, wait for it. Let me find it. A box full of the, um, pink you know the jazzles like the pink love hearts absolutely love these i should have got them in white as well but they're just oh love so i'm gonna have a couple of those while i work and then that will be it until dinner time dinner is served oh my god homemade lasagna with lots of veggies lots of veggies delicious really So I realised when editing the video, I actually didn't do an outro, um, I didn't properly finish the vlog. So I'm going to do the outro a couple of days on. Basically, dessert, I had some of the um, low calorie ice cream from Lidl. Um, their salted caramel and then their chocolate flavour, I think it was, which was amazing. I absolutely love that. And then I also had a Reese's King Size Barb, I had half of it. Um, so yeah, that is, oh, I love that, it's just like a Snickers but like a a Snickers that has doubled in like thickness and everything and like nuts and everything so it's really good um but yeah that is roughly like my days of eating um like I said like I'm loosely tracking I'm doing now 20 minutes cardio a day so it's not that much even on rest days I'm doing that as well so that's not bad um training is, is going okay like I think everyone's just in the same position aren't they where it's kind of some days are really good some days are very poor <laughs> and then some days are just they're write-offs um but do you know what we, we just keep we keep trying our best and we're just taking each day as it comes i hope this was a little bit helpful um and it gave you some ideas i'll do another one next week i reckon because i have again changed up like what i'm eating i'm adding other stuff in um but yeah i'm actually really enjoying just kind of loosely tracking and just picking foods that i've missed having um and just enjoying food like baking like i'm loving baking i'm baking at least once a week um which obviously you can't do on prep um but i absolutely miss prep and i should be on stage this weekend which that's that's really weird feeling like i should be on stage on sunday and today it's thursday um yeah it, it's weird like it feels really weird i think we're gonna get a takeaway this weekend just to kind of cheer me up in that sense um but positive thoughts guys absolutely positive thoughts i'm gonna come back and i'm gonna be better because i'll be in a better starting position mindset wise i'll be in a good spot because i've definitely learned some good things like being in lockdown um i've taken time out for myself like i've stopped working when it like reaches like 5 36 p.m like turning my phone off which i'm a nightmare for absolute nightmare um like appreciating smaller things and just everything like i think harv and i have become closer as well from it because obviously we're spending so much more time together um so yeah there are some positives we look at the positives 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the like button. And if there's any videos you want to see, let me know. I am debating doing a foodie challenge this weekend. I've been the, the mention of like me having his diet for a day because obviously he eats like 6,000 to 6,000 calories, like 5,000, 6,000 roughly. Um, so I'll be in heaven. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see. Um, thank you guys so much for watching and tune in next week.